we look at it like it, it, it's a part of our legacy. It was it was something that, you know, for us, we wanted little girls uh, to grow up knowing that they had a professional league uh, to look forward to playing in. Um, so what that meant was they, they got in the gym and they worked hard, you know, to make sure that that product on the floor is something that people want to come see night in and night out. So every time I see the WNBA and each year that passes by, you know, I'm happy. I'm happy because, you know, little girls can dream of playing in their own country. It was the ABL first and, you know, I was a product of that and then I, you know, had an opportunity to play in the WNBA for a while and a long time and started out in, D in D.C. But the fan support was amazing. You know, when I was in D.C., we led the you know, we led the nation in attendance. You know, Shamiqua Hoskoff from Tennessee came to our team and it was just, you know, they embraced, you know, players. You know, they embraced our league and, you know, obviously they watched our Olympic players and, you know, you know, the Lisa Leslie's, the Don Steele's and the Cheryl Swoops, you know, they fell in love with those players and we just kind of rode their coattails.